God, I thank you right now in the name of Jesus for your word. God, I thank you for what you're doing in our lives. God, you are showing up and showing out in them, God. We thank you, God, for you are always in the midst, moved by your spirit's power, God. Oh, God, show up, God. Show up, God. Show up, God. Put us on our knees. Put us on our knees. Teach us the meaning, God. Oh, God. Not a retreat, but a revival, God. I want to be revived, God. I want to live again. You said live and live again. You want us to have a life and life more abundantly. Pick us up out the book and mire, God. Oh, God, you made me from clay, God. From dirt, right? You made me from clay. That does not, uh, that does not mean that I should be playing in it. That does not mean I should be a, a fussing in it. I don't need to fuss with dirt again. I was made from it, and when you made me, you stood me up. You breathed life into me, and now I know how to shower. And I get clean in it. Because the Bible says, First John 1 and 9 says, If you confess your sins, he is faithful and just to forgive you and cleanse you from all your unrighteousness not dirty you to all unrighteousness right he ain't turning me back to the dirt again i ain't going back to uh, 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 eden i ain't going back to hell i ain't going back to uh, wherever i was in new jersey i ain't going back there uh, hallelujah the bricks can keep the bricks and i i'm leaving the ghetto behind and it's effect god told me this morning say jump out to my blog and say jim you have a ghetto effect uh, affect uh, that's been infected uh, by and affected by living in the ghetto. Uh, thank you, God, uh, for showing me that. Uh, now I can go to work on it. Uh, I'm excited. I'm excited. I said, well, What happens when my pastor realizes um, that I am actually, I deal with bipolar, deal with bipolar, right? And that actually, I, I do really need to talk. What happens when he realizes I need <laughs> that I'm on my required time and patience? What happens? See, I said that, and I said, what happens when you realize oh, that I will not do something wrong? That was a question. Why do I, I make you and God mad? Because it's going to happen. When a real question, that I, that, I, I was, that, I was, that was transposed and disposed and covered up by my affect. The real question is, uh, what happens when you realize that I actually need help? I need help. No, that's, that's not how we sing it, right? I need your help, God. Maybe they hide. I need your help, God. Maybe they hide. He said, Me, 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 take for all your fashion. Maybe they hide. He said, You have been weighed in the balance and have come up wanting. Remember that? You have been weighed in the balance and come up wanting. Jamie, you want and want and want. And so I said, I'm on my way to ministry. I'm on my way to glory. And I'm just passing through here. I'm saying that. But what happens when, oh God, maybe they hide. What happens? You are Timothy to that Paul. Money for your test. You don't get money for your test if you leave your test to money early. You don't. I, God already showed me I, I'm a runner, so I leave things, right? So that, that's what I do. I don't do it no more. But I, I run away. I, I'm just, I'm, that's where, that's where, that's, that's, I, that, that's where I come from. That's people I come from. Runners. Attract stars, right? But he showed me, he said, Jamie, if you leave early, you, 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 you default. I said, what man? I looked at it. Paul said, he said, Timothy was a son to him, right, in the gospel. He was a son to him in the gospel. We started studying it last week. I saw that. I said, ain't this a blip? So then I looked up at that going and kept going up even further. I said, wait a minute. It was Paul and it was Timothy and Titus. For a second, Timothy, Titus, right? That's the way it goes, right? Those are the two the men that got pastoral epistles, right? You don't get the, you don't get the, the wine if you can't handle the bread. Judas must have been you getting drunk off yeast. God said drop. He said you get ceremonial wine and he said drop the bud. How wiser. You are no wiser than you were last year because you picked up a bud. God showed me on John's oh, street. He said look up malt, Jamie. And so I thank you, God. For who you are. Oh God, oh God, oh God, we need you. Hallelujah. Oh, for you are holy. Change our key. Change our key. Yeah. Oh, so holy. See, we see this whole, holy song about um, I will build my life upon your love. But that's not how we sing. <laughs> In the ghetto, you are holy. Oh, so holy. What a privilege and an honor. 
to worship at your throne, to be called into your presence as your own. We need that stipulation, right? Funny thing is, I like our holy now. I like the way we sing it now. I will build my life upon. <laughs> I like this holy. I'm going to keep this one. I trade, I, I trade that one in. Because what happens when, right, what you guys don't hear, by the way, I'm singing the song, is that Tracy would get up and sing that um, as a solo right before she preached. Like every Sunday, every time she preached, she would just get up and sing that song. But if she's singing it as a solo, I look crazy if I'm standing up singing with her. So I can't sing that holy, right, the way I want to. But I will build my life up, huh? <laughs> I rock that. Because I get to sing that every Sunday if I want to. Even the David Lewis don't choose it for the little lineup. I can line up with it. With me with God with it. it. I can I sing it the way I want to. Me, God with it. Right? Either way, no matter your higher, he's holy. Hey, man, I lie. Uh, he's holy. Hey. And so we thank you, God. And it's, uh, we thank you, God, for the expression, God. Uh, I don't want to be that sing so low, low, so. Uh, oh, uh, nobody can hear me. That's what they told me. Jim, you need, that's what you need to focus on. That's your gift. Sing so low, nobody can hear you. And they meant it. And I understand that. <laughs> Hallelujah, because he's changing our key. Mine, mine, take well, you Pharisee. And funny thing, we're sitting in a choir rehearsal because we had choir rehearsal. Like my half my life was spent choir rehearsal. It just was, and I didn't mind. I liked it. We're all singing a song, and of course it's a three-part harmony. And I sang soprano with Teresa, and everybody, all other women in church sang alto. <laughs> and then uh. Somebody, a couple of men, the missing tenor, the missing tenor. There's no men altos. It doesn't work like that. <laughs> so they're singing this song, they're learning this song, and Missy has a beautiful voice, but it's basic. It's like she takes basic songs and she can rip them. She take them and turn them and rip them, right? But Missy has, a, she's a choir director, but she has a basic voice. So when she saw, uh, brought the song to us, we started singing it. So she sang it uh, for us. Uh, she said, sing this part, sing this part, sing this part. But I always fall into this thing where I sing what I hear. So if I don't like what I'm hearing, you won't see me sing. So everybody's singing that note, singing that note, singing that note. And everybody singing the right note. And when I started singing, I sang something totally off in it. So, and she looked at Shelvin. She said, huh? And Shelvin said, yup. What if it's not that I could not sing, it's just that I always sing in the key that you could not hear. What if, right, heaven is connected to your praise, right? So heaven comes down and meets you, God, excuse me, comes down and meets you and starts stirring a pot, stirring things up, right? Because he says he inhabits the place of the people. What happens when he is doing that but you can't see him because you have not told him to inhabit or have his habits inside or inside of the situation with you? What happens? What happens when I'm just like you, right? I said, this is one thing, I am a black, right? Or you're just like me. I said, this is one thing, you are Caucasian, right? What happens on occasion? You are Caucasianally, right? Correcting me because I don't look like you. And so we can't get with it. So the only choice I had, God takes me and puts me right back in the clock tower and say, you study with him. What happens when I, now this is a geriatric Bible study I'm not getting kicked out of? God is kicking me out of it. Well, I'm, what happens when you're trying to bring the cross into everything except that we have not met you in the all things? Uh, many are the afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord will deliver them out of all. <laughs> what does that look like? To get delivered out of it all. Oh, I need you, God, and I need you more than uh, my all. All of you, Lord, none of me, God, I need you, God. Oh, I need God, right? We need God in the all. The Psalm 34, verse 19, all, right? Because when I get God in the all, then I'm not missing Him in the all these things, right? Matthew 6.33 says, Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and all these things shall be added unto you. You are missing out what God wants to give to you. Why? Because you are seeking God. God don't need you stalking him. He ain't got any sense. You know, he ain't left the throne and five billion, hundred thousand 
of the months of the years of the uh the I got crackers inside my basket and I got paintings in the living room. He got uh, all that. He, he ain't leaving the throne. He don't abdicate. He's a king. Uh, he kings don't abdicate thrones, not real ones. So how can you see God? You know where he at? He said, come boldly before the throne of grace that you may obtain mercy. And it's after my new mercy. Lamentations 3.23 affords me. So about what am I looking for him for? I know where he's at. Romans 3.23 leads me to Lamentations 3.23. 3.23 to 3.23, right? Because I fall short in all these things, right? God still gets the glory and gives me new mercies when I come before him. But I got to come before him, right? Boldly, not breastly, right? To get my... New mercies. I need more than just a little, um, a little bit of mercies. The new mercies is good, Holy Spirit. But I need some more because I'm Jamie and you know I be, I be killing stuff. I do. So but seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. And it doesn't take seek ye first God. And so a lot of people, because they only know the Bible, right? They don't understand the inspiration behind it. It's the, the, the Bible, the word of God, right? The inspiration of the word of God is Jesus Christ. So the Bible will never point you to God. Because being pointed to God will only lead you to what? To Pastor David, let me know last week. Performance Christianity. Uh, come on, no, no, no. I, 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 I had the law. We had the law. We had the Pentateuch, the Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, and Deuteronomy, right? We had that. That was a law that led us to God, right? To, and sacrificing. But without uh, the shedding of blood, come on, no, no, no. there will be no remissions of sin. So I need the shedding of blood, right? Uh, to top it all off. The law leads you to God, but the law leads to destruction because I cannot come before God without a sprinkling of the blood covering me right he said oh god he said uh, 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 um, when you pray you gotta pray in the name of jesus in the name of jesus so be it in jesus name 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 it is so in jesus name it is yo why y'all think i do that i like to make it fun because everybody else say in the name of jesus okay but, but can you sing it Okay, but can you say it with flair? <laughs> you say I'm pretty, now can you sing it with flair? Show off. <laughs> so Ben and Jesus thing. <laughs> it's just really ghetto and ratchet for a woman to sing like that. So I'll do it. I gotta do it then. Okay, that's my cue. <laughs> I gotta do it different. I gotta do everything different. Y'all know me. I'm doing a whole exhibit. God said the whole exhibit is gonna be clay. <laughs> I ain't painting nothing. Stephen and Christina and, 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 and Miss Jones, Stephen's mama, and Ashley and Dan, everybody bought me paint. I think Nick bought me some paint too. Everybody bought me paint and I'm not going to use it. God said no. He said the whole exhibit, James. The whole exhibit. Do you understand whole, W-H-O-L-E? Whole exhibit is going to be um, clay. People don't do mold clay by the sculptor or they paint on the board, but nobody puts paint clay on the board. Okay, so I got to do it. That's my thing. I got to do it. <laughs> I don't do paint. I do clay. That's it. I can paint. I have paintings in my house. A bunch of them. All over the place. How many walked in was like, wow, Gallery of Jamie. Wow. She's seen them all. Wow. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I know. I love it. It's clay, it's clay and paint everywhere. I have painted, but I did that. I'm bored. <laughs> I'm a little bored. That whole exhibit is going to be clay. May be no clay. In Jesus' name. I can't get what, I'm, what I want from God from it to, without following his instructions. He said clay, so I do clay. Cash is clay? No, clay. <laughs> if, I'm, if I'm seeking the kingdom of God, right, that points to his son, it does not point to, it does not point to God. You are seeking the law, and the law leads to death. Law, Moses, death. Law, Moses, Sinai, Hagar, death. Put them together. Egypt, Egypt, say it with yourself. Say it with yourself, because I'm not there. So say it with yourself. <laughs> Promise, Isaac, Jesus, Mount Moriah, Calvary, whole Bible, word. Get it. The Bible says, seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and all these things will be added unto you. He is promising you that he will give you all these things that you are asking for. Not, it says, what is it? Psalm 27 verse 5, right? One thing have I desired of the Lord and that will I seek after the, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life and to behold the beauty of the Lord and to inquire in his temple. I love me some Psalm 27. Until you get to 14. That's where we kind of part ways a little bit. 
I'm trying. He's not, he's not promising to give you the one thing. What he's telling you is if you seek the kingdom of God first, all those things will be added unto you, right? But what you are trying to do is make your own reward. And then Jesus said, uh-uh, I'm, not, I'm coming back and my reward is with me in Revelation 22, 17. Tell me this, riddle me this, Riddler. If Jesus comes back with a reward for your works that you're supposed to be doing, uh, about, uh, what are you doing? Working for your own reward? That's performance Christianity. He said, I don't know, they said, uh, my pastor wrote the song, wrote the song, I'm trading my sorrows. Uh, so a lot of people sing out the songs that don't know it. <laughs> he like it like that, because he gets to stay normal. I'm trading my sorrows. Don't go like that, don't sound like that. Look it up and listen. I'm trading my shame. I'm laying it down for the joy of the Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, not yes, Bible. Yes, Lord, not yes, God. Right? I'm not, I'm not taking anything away from God. Have some common sense and hear me out. You're seeking the kingdom of God because you can't come before God unless you come with a son. That's what people are. Okay, I didn't get a response from God. Let me go to Bahamut. Okay, I didn't get a response from God. Let me go to Buddha, Buddha, chang, 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 and, and start chanting. That's not tongue, sweetie. I don't know what you're doing. June 20 is what I do. What is that? <laughs> If you would seek the kingdom of God and stop running from it and truly seek it and not put your stipulations and your limits on it. Because I'll tell you this much, even when I pray, I know when I'm going left and i got to start all over again in my prayer. And that's why I started like 4 o'clock in the morning, 5 o'clock in the morning. Because even when I pray, right, I will feel the Holy Spirit just slip on out of there if I start praying things that are not in line with this word. Okay? I don't go to the Holy Spirit and say, why you leave me? No, what I do is I say, okay, i got to start all over again. i got to start all over. I am the one that needs, I need help. So if I'm the one that needs help, I'm going to tell the helper what to give me. If I'm the one that come out that's walking through the test, I'm going to tell the testator how to testator me. Right? I'm looking for a testimony. So it says, I need money for my test. I told my pastor, I said, kick me, punch me, slap me in the back of the neck, do whatever you got to do. Uh, just like that, that face. Uh, uh, do whatever you got to do to keep me on the way. Uh, right? Because narrow is the way. And on the side is your Buddha and your Baal and your... uh. Muhammad and all that stuff, and the sun and the moons. He's the way. I don't say he's the way. If he's the way that you're going to light, then the kingdom of God is Jesus Christ. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things will be added unto you. That's why I get my all these things, right? So I know, right? In that, but when all these things are added unto us, you realize it's not ever what we think it's going to be, right? Because he got thorns, right? And when we got a crown of them, he went to glory. That's why he got a throne. You guys get a throne from, if you keep your thorns, you get a throne from them. Ask Paul about it. But if you go and you don't have your thorns with you, you are bankrupt in it. Here's the thing. Since he had those thorns, you want to when you start seeking him and walk in his way and walk on the way you will have thorns too but check this out the promises oh god the man that has the throne now said i'm coming back and my reward is with me and i've got a i got a mansion in my house yeah yeah it ain't gonna be like it was with jonah he gonna give you a plant to lean on no it ain't gonna be like it was with jamie you want me uh um, homeless for like 15 years of your life no Although I did tell Miss Melanie that there are going to be homeless people in heaven. Get it right. If he said I'm coming back and my reward is with me, right? I'm coming back and my reward is with me. And everybody starts working at the uh, morning and at the night and at the different times of the day. They all get the same denarius, whatever that is, penny, whatever that is. Everybody gets a penny. Now I'm not asking because I, I know I found myself in this category before, but what happens to those people that get the penny and start complaining about it? You see it, because at the end of the story he explains it. The people that, he has to explain it because the workers that were there since the beginning of the day started complaining. Everybody gets the same amount, but the Bible does not work where you get, com- where you get reward for complaint. Because the moment you start complaining, your reward, and he starts pulling it away, he starts snatching it away. That's why it's not performance. It's grace based. Because I can't earn it. He took my, my trespasses in my sin. My Ephesians 2, 1 through 3. I tried to do this already. Go with me. He took my Ephesians 2, 1 through 3. I told Greta about it last week. I was like, Pastor David told me some good stuff. What, what, what? <clears throat> and I tried to explain to Greta. She was like, 
Huh? I said, Greta, Greta, eat with me. Then I said, like, I, I told Terry, Tori yesterday. He took my Ephesians 2, 1 through 3. He took my death and gave me life in it. He took, he took my Ephesians 2, 1 through 3. And that gave me back Ephesians 2, 8 through 10. And then I watched another sermon he did. It was on, it was on Easter Sunday, 2021. And he preached on it again. And so I felt like that was a God's gift, right, to Jamie. Because I needed some uh, that backing and the foundation of it. Because I realized, I said, uh, I got up and I wrote it last night. I didn't send it to him because it was late. Because I was up watching his videos. I'm watching his videos. His videos are playing basically all night. Because if I have something playing in my ears, it's not going to be Kim Kardashian or Dan Rathers with the rather than that news judge me hate me uh, whatever you want to be here but God already told me here uh, if I'm going to study study here with him so that's what I'm doing he just don't know it he, he knows I'm watching him but he just don't know I'm, I'm studying like that I watched that Thessalonians video again because I like the maps and I like to look at it and I got to figure out what is it about the Asian way. I don't know if I'm saying it right. A-E-G-E-A way and way. Whose way? Apparently Asians. Asians got their own way. They bought it. <laughs> they was on an overnight circle and they passed by Elijah way where they exchanged prophets. Elijah said, I got some prophets. Overnight said, give me some. Then that, 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 that's where it happened. No, okay. The Asian way. 